For several years in the late 70s, a band that got its start in a Bellevue basement ruled rock and roll radio. <laughs> you know, when you step on a stage and 10,000 people are just going, yeah, you haven't played yet. It's, it's a great thing. We started out here over 40 years ago, a garage band with a dream bigger than a garage. We wrote a lot of songs and we figured we knew what they meant. In 1975, Brother Mike and I and the Wilson sisters, Anne and Nancy, were living in Vancouver, Canada, busily launching our new group, Heart. In the middle of the crowd, riding the soundboard, band manager Mike Fisher was watching a dream come true. I just had this vision for what those people could become, and I was totally fired up and passionate about it. It didn't hurt that Nancy and Roger seemed to be hitting it off. Mike and Anne were already together. She wrote Magic Man about him. And there's more drama in this kind of crazy sexual politics of the band Heart than any band, I think, in rock history. As Heart, they made history, thanks in large part to the Magic Man. After Heart, keeping positive in the face of life's challenges was difficult at times. But our artistic growth and transformation explodes in the One Vision Project. Oh. 